You know, oftentimes on the morning show, I show pictures from some of my travels. So the station had an idea that every month I should take you to a unique town or village in our area. So this month we take you from Madison all the way out to Gaze Mills. It's in a driftless region. That's an area known in southwest Wisconsin. It's about a two hour drive from Madison. Here it is. What many people may remember about Gay's Mills is this back to back 100 year floods in 2007 and 2008. We lost about 40% of our residents when we, between the two floods, we went from about 700 down to under 500. So that kind of hurts. To only remember Gay's Mills for this would be to miss out on how beautiful it is today. The drive along Highway 60 from the Madison area draws thousands of visitors every year. And so do the apple orchards that sit high atop the hills above the village. Great way to spend a day in the fall. Great apples, you know, has a nice, nice, just a nice easy thing to do. Tourists come by the bus loads while others pack their trunks full of treats. Sunrise Orchards has been in the same family since 1934, offering 18 varieties of apples and products. It's a family business from the picking of the apple to the shipping of the apple. A family member is, is active in every step in process. So. While you're there, take a trip down to the valley floor. Gaze Mill sits along the banks of the Kickapoo River where trout, northerns, and bass are abundant. When you walk out in these woods and you sit down, that's what I call God's country. It's peaceful. Nature not only provides a beautiful backdrop, but it drives the local economy. And it's not just apples. Morels every spring, where people are now getting 60 and $70 a pound by delivering them to places like La Crosse and Madison for resale. During our visit, we learned the tiny hazelnut could be the next big thing. It's something that's been here all of, all of our life growing up, but someone just finally found a purpose for it outside the local farmer using it. The American Hazelnut Company in Gay's Mills is now producing gluten-free flour and hazelnut oil. A lot of new young businesses are starting to grow, which is great, finally. They're starting to come in. And those who do have embraced it. A newcomer has sort of a slight advantage because we don't take this beauty for granted. Every morning when I wake up, I say, wow. Gay's Mills has seen its share of hardships, but with the beauty of its surroundings and the promise of future success, it truly embodies Wisconsin's motto, forward. In Gay's Mills, Christine Belport, NBC 15. I wanted to thank uh, who you saw in the story, Harry, the town president, also Brad of the Culinary Center in Gaze Mills, and Ryan, who is the founder's grandson of oh. Sunrise Orchards. I gotta say, I love this new series because these are areas that normally we may not go and visit. Mm -hmm. In Gaze yeah. Mills, we get to see what it actually looks like and oh, yeah. things to do there that would be interesting. It it's great. It was incredible.